Welcome back everyone. Today I am starting a new build. I kind of finished up all my projects and I have this bike that's been sitting out here for a while. So I'm gonna take it apart and see what it needs. Ho ho. Ho ho ho. Let's go. Today I am working on the Derby Diablo. I believe this is the C5 version, which has a piston, okay, has a pyramid reed engine. This was the C5 with a, had a pyramid reed engine. So I'm gonna put on a flat reed, I think. So I think I'll put on a flat reed. Ugh. Mm -hmm. I believe originally, okay. I believe originally this was a C5 with a pyramid reed engine. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it apart today and see what we're working with and figure out kind of what I can do. I think a lot of the parts will have to be remade. I'm hoping the frame is good, the tank is good, and the swing arm is good. I think everything else I can deal with or replace or figure out. This does have a new Golden Boy in the back and a bi-turbo baffle, which is sweet. All right, the frame is good, forks are shot. The tank is rusty um, and full of spider webs, but I actually think the tank is really good. It's got some stuff in there, but it's actually one piece, no holes, I don't think, and there are no dents. The seat, which looks good, is completely gone. There is no seat pan. There's part of a seat pan, but not enough. So we will have to make a new seat for it. So the frame is good, that is great news. I believe this flat reed will fit right in. All right, I think this is gonna work. The swing arm is also good. So I'm gonna use the frame, the swing arm, the tank, and then I'm gonna do different forks, a different seat, and maybe different wheels. We will see. All right, y'all, this is as far as I got today. I am going to clean up this frame, cut off a whole bunch of tabs, and figure out how the engine mounts in here with the swing arm and the wheels. I'm gonna probably do the rear swing arm first and then figure out what kind of forks I wanna do. Whether I do moped forks or dirt bike forks, we'll see. And then I gotta figure out my wheel size if I'm gonna do the 1821 or 1717. Thank you for watching. Please stay tuned for future updates. Have a great day and buy me a coffee if you can.